Hey, what's up, Cyberheads? Doss the Ball coming back at you. Just wanted to do a quick little update on my Taurus 24-7 G2 and 40 Smith & Wesson. Now, I posted an unboxing of this firearm a couple weeks back. Since then, I've been able to get it out to the range twice. I've put uh, precisely 200 rounds through it, a uh, mix of ammunition. Now, the first time I took it out, I ran a mix of tool ammo and PMC bronze. And unfortunately, I had to report about 10 failures to feed between both types of ammo. Now, while the gun shot, you know, relatively well, I attributed this to the weapons break-in period. Maybe the magazines were giving me issues, you know, they were still a little bit stiff. <clears throat> the gun itself still was a little stiff. I did take it apart and clean it up and all that before I took it out. Uh, but, um, you know, not all firearms are built equally that's not ripping on Taurus actually I've heard a lot of bad things about Taurus and to be honest with you for the most part I'm satisfied with the weapon uh, I'd buy another one let's just leave it at that anyway so about two or three days ago I had a chance to take it out for the second time and I shot 50 rounds of Federal and another 50 of tool ammo now the 50 shots of Federal let's get to that first um, I've read here and there that it, you, sh you should keep your uh, new magazines fully loaded just to help, you know, with spring tension and all that. So I did that for about a week or so before I took it out the second time. I also noticed that on the followers, when I took the magazines apart, some of them had a little bit, uh, the edges were a little rough on them. So I sanded them down, thought that might be uh, part of the problem, why it was uh, giving me problems to feed. And... Um, you know, as always, ammo probably was an issue. So back to the Federal. 180 grain, full metal jackets, 50 rounds, no problem. Shot sweet, nice groupings, everything was great. Then I switched over to tool ammo. Loaded up a few mags, and that's when the fun started. Second round of the first magazine, failure to feed. Same thing with the third round, same thing with the fifth round. So I changed magazines put in a new mag, uh, once again, second round, failure to feed, third round, failure to feed. In total, out of the box, I would say I had about another nine failures to feed out of 50 rounds of tool ammo. So my conclusion is the weapon has nothing wrong with it. It's the ammo that's giving me a problem. And while I've shot tool ammo out of my AR without an issue, um, most guns are, well, can be finicky about what they like to shoot. And apparently, this guy doesn't like tool ammo. So, those are my preliminary findings thus far. It's only been a week. Like I said, I've only got 200 rounds through her. But that Federal really made me think that it's probably the tool ammo that's giving me the, the problem. So, I'm going to run about another 100 to 200 rounds through it, which would pretty much put me out of the break-in period. And I'll be back with what I think at that point. But so far definitely still holding strong i would still recommend this weapon to anyone who's interested they run pretty cheap you probably get one for anywhere between you know 350 to 400 which i think is more than well worth uh the money for the firearm two magazines 15 shots actually i've only been able to get 14 in mine so well, i don't know maybe it's the springs maybe it's me who knows but if you can't hit what you need to hit with 14 rounds, bro, uh, you, you better start running. Anyway, that was the ball uh, signing off. Hope you guys have a good one, and I'll see you again. All righty.